I am just about done with my iMovie project, except for some background music. One of two things. I can simply tap the cog wheel in the lower right hand corner and select theme music. I can also change my theme here and do a project filter if I'd like for the whole thing. So I'm going to turn on theme music. You can fade in from, the, from black, fade out to black, speed changes to pitch. Those are just some other options. So I'm going to use that. I'm going to go ahead and use that theme. And now you notice I have some green uh, wavelength bar underneath my audio recording. So let's check this out. I attended the Samurai Teacher Camp in Downers Grove School District 58 last weekend with about 300 educators. The first session I went to was all about... Okay, now I have the same... I could do the same adjustment, ad adjustments like I did with my voiceover with the music where I can select the background music and tap the volume and I could decrease it if the volume is too loud for your voiceover or I could go back and increase the voiceover. You can also, towards the end of the video, this is pretty cool, select it and tap fade. And then move this arrow and it will automatically kind of fade out at the end. So it kind of is like, well, fades out. And then it gets a little bit lower. So that's one quick option of adding music by just going to the wheel and using the theme music throughout. Another um, option is if you tap audio in the upper right hand corner, you can also go to all the different theme musics and you can add um, a few different ones. So you can have one song at the beginning, one in the middle, a different one at the end. You can also add some sound effects. So like an applause, kids love to do this one. <laughs> Adding in a little applause at the end, um, you know, booing, booing crowd, there's some fun ones. Okay, you can also have access to uh, recordings, playlists, albums, artists, artists, songs, and your and your iCloud Drive. So let's say to you make a sound ringtone or something in GarageBand, or if you have music in your iTunes, you can import that into here as well. So that is how you add some background music to your finished iMovie 